All right, Shalom. Let's start first by giving all praise and glory to the Yah, Bashim Yashah, Bashim Arakah Kodash. Just um, double honor to the apostles and elders at Great Millstone who rule well. Green salutations and blessings unto the hopeful elect. Real quick video, I want to throw uh, this out there. Brother Ayasha Moth from the GMS Mississippi camp. His brother sent me a, a link to uh, this story, man. Zebra dies from stress after breaking out of Christmas circus. Man, <laughs> you either might going to get destroyed, man. Most high is going to kill you people, okay? He's going he gonna, to... He gonna, Put you where you belong, man. He's gonna put you. Thus said the Bible. He's gonna, he's gonna, he's gonna destroy you that hurt the earth, man. You hurt the earth. You hurt the animals of the earth. The animals ain't did nothing to you, man. A zebra, you got him in the Christmas, like you, you with these circuses and all of this, man. Using these animals in, in, in harmful and hurtful ways. Most high is gonna destroy you, man. It's gonna destroy you gonna destroy you man he gonna make the house of Esau for stubble man pursuing the Obadiah alright he's gonna jack you people up man hold on bear with me one second let me share some mute that's gonna, the most high is gonna jack you people up man watch the video right quick Beautiful animal like that, man. Beautiful animal like that, man. Y'all are shy uh name the animals. How would uh, have those animals uh be precious in the earth like that, man? And you just making them do Christmas caroling or whatever you're doing, man. Whatever your wicked ass is out there doing, Esau, whatever you're doing, man, that's gonna come you gonna you're gonna have to get judged, man. There's a judgment coming. There's a judgment coming. And for all you people that think that shit's cool, it's a judgment coming for you. Okay? It's a judgment. Because you condone him doing all this wicked stuff by going to these Christmas plays. Pa Christmas is pagan anyway. You condone all of that madness, man. You condone that BS. Okay? Let me get let me get these scriptures closed out. This wasn't meant to be all that, but man, it's tired of this shit, man. The animals, whales beaching themselves, bees and birds falling out the sky, destroying the ecosystem over here. The earth is in mourning under the rule of you people. I, I'm going to always bring this up, man, because this is the best analogy that I ever considered about how the so-called white man, as uh, like it says in Job 29. Well, let me get it, man. Let me just get it right quick, Salakia. Let me get it right quick. <clears throat> 24, Job 9 and 24, the earth is given into the hand of the wicked. He covers the faces of the judges thereof, if not, where and who is he? If this ain't the wicked that's ruling the earth that has his hand uh, uh, <clears throat> on the earth right now. When you go and you read in Genesis, the 27th chapter, you know, when it's talking about uh, when thou shalt have dominion, you had a fatness of the earth and so on and so forth. This is what this man does with the earth, man. This is what he does with it. He destroys it. He's the destroyer. He's the son of perdition. He's the son of the wicked. Okay? This is what he does with it, okay? This is exactly what this man does. All right? <clears throat> Nothing good for the planet, all right? But there's going to come a day uh that's that this is all gonna change all right it says when the righteous are in the this is Salakia, proverbs 29 and verse 2 when the righteous are in authority the people rejoice when we finally get the planet back with the proper uh rules written in our hearts okay it's written in us to where we're performing the law perfectly and the world the world will be in righteousness we have the bodies that that truly uh, are necessary, the extraterrestrial body that's necessary to live in complete righteousness, that deserve complete righteousness. 
that's when the world is going to be in, in complete joy and in, in, uh, in, in, in harmony, man. Okay? Because this devil is destroying this place. The analogy I always love to use is Esau treats the world like a rental car that's not in his name. Just put water and sugar in the gas tank. Just trying to destroy this shit. Trying to do jackass stunts and, 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 and run off off road and all just all types of whatever he can do. He just trying to just use this up and burn it all up, man. So nobody else get it. Just kamikaze with the planet, man. So nobody else gets a, a, a good turn. The Most High's had enough. He's had enough. That's why you're going down. Okay? That's why you're going down. It's tired of your shit, man. Zebras can't even just be be wild no more. I mean, it's bad enough. It's bad enough you got him in the zoo. But now you got him in a goddamn circus. He escapes so stressed out. He just heart attack and dies or something, man. I didn't read deep into the article. I don't need to read deep into the article. You shouldn't be having your hands on the animals. Fucking, was it Steve Irwin? The the, the crocodile hunter or whatever his name was? The hell, you, you, you all in the waters messing with stingrays for? Why are you hunting crocodiles and whatever else you're doing? Look at the little dingo over here. Nobody want to hear about that shit, man. It's nice to see animals, but you, with all the, the, the technology and the cameras that, that you Edomites got, you can watch these animals from afar, man. You ain't got to mess with them. You, you do not have to mess with them. But you over there, you, you torture animals to get them to do what you want them to do. You calling yourself training them and domesticating them. <sighs> Most High is going to kill you people. He's going to kill you people straight up, man. Thus said the Bible. All right. Anyway, um, when the righteous are in authority, the people rejoice. But when the wicked bear the rule, the people mourn. The world is in mourning as we speak. Animals dying off, whales and, and sharks and dolphins and, and uh, some other little uh, seals and whatever else beaching themselves. Trying to just, the water is so polluted, they just want to get out of it. The air is so polluted, the birds are falling out the sky. Bees don't want to pollinate plants no more. They're like, that ain't a real daisy. That's a, or a, real, ain't a real flower. That's GMO flowers. Like, it's ridiculous what this man is doing to this planet. Ridiculous. You think the Most High don't see you? You think there's no judgment for this? It's coming. Though, ex though uh, uh, since it's a, against an evil work, isn't executed speedily. Um. Let me get it. Just get it. Just get it. It says, uh, because sentence against an evil work, this is Ecclesiastes, the 8th chapter, the 11th verse, because sentence against an evil work is not executed speedily. Therefore, the heart of the sons of men is fully set in them to do evil. Fully set in you to do evil, man. Evil. Most High is going to get you, man. It says, Though a sinner do evil a hundred times and his days be prolonged, yet surely I know that it shall be well with the with them that fear the Most High God which fear before him. But it shall not be well with the wicked. Neither shall he prolong his days as are as a shadow because he fear not before the Most High God. Most High is going to kill you people, man. For all your wickedness, man. You've, pu you've pushed wickedness on the earth, man. And the animals and the trees and the, everything's tired of you, man. Close out with one more script. Go to the book of Isaiah 14. Start around 7, I think it was. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Uh, oh, yeah. Um, I'll start with verse 5. I'll start with verse 4. Isaiah 14, 4, thou shalt take up this proverb against the king of Babylon. The king of Babylon, which is the virgin daughter of Babylon, the great daughter of Babylon, right? Which is America in particular. But you, it's you Edomites, man. And all your whole power structure that you run, okay? That's you. You're the king of Babylon, all right? King of confusion, all right? It says, and say, how have the oppressors ceased? The golden city ceased. 
And America is that golden city. Okay? You're the oppressor. How, is, how have you ceased? Because Yahweh Bashim Yahshai has come back to reign righteousness upon earth, and you will be taken out. Okay? It says, The Lord hath broken the staff of the wicked and the scepters of the rulers. He who smote the people and the animals and the, and the earth itself. Okay? This man smote everything. He only knows destruction. It says, he who smote the people in wrath with a continual stroke and kept doing it, man. It said, he that ruled the nations in anger is persecuted and none hindereth. Yeah, I can't wait till this man is fully persecuted. Okay? To set the world back in righteousness. And, and, and he's crumbling now. He's on his way out now. You can see it. You can see how his people are, are reacting in the streets, man. Right, it says uh, the whole earth is at rest and is quiet. Once you're gone, the whole earth will be at rest and will be quiet. Okay, and at peace. And at peace. It says they break forth in the singing. Everything, the people, everybody that 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 long for righteousness, you're gonna break into singing and rejoicing. Okay, even the heathen. How about the other heathen, the other nations? Okay, you Edomites going to be upset because you want more wickedness on the earth. But all everybody else is going to be like, finally, we hated that dude for so many centuries. Right? It says, uh, yea, the fir trees rejoice at thee. The trees are going to rejoice. And righteousness and the cedars of Lebanon saying, since thou laid down, no feller has come up against us. Since we laid that wicked man down, nobody's been tripping, man. We we get our we get our seven our Sabbath uh, seven uh, year rest, seven day rest, seven year rest. We get the jubilee. We get all these things that are written in our laws on how to govern the earth. Those things will be in full effect, man. The laws will be in full effect and, and, and everybody on earth will be, be happy being under the laws of Yahweh Hashem Yahshah. Okay? This man's a goddamn devil, man. He's got to go. Baba Kushah, Yahweh Hashem Yahshah. Haragim call Adawamim. Okay? Baba Kusha, Baba Kusha, Baba Kusha. Yahweh Bashim Yahshah, Brakata. With that, I'm going to close out giving all praises and glories unto Yahweh Bashim Yahshah. Brakata, Yahweh, Brakata, Yahweh. Shai, call all Yahweh Bashim Yahshah. Shalom.